three series, one CT and two PET. We need the, the CT series. Please open the CT series with 226 images. And go down to the liver. And in the liver you see two big lesions, this one and this one. And um, we want to measure the size, the volume of this lesion. We cannot use this segmentation algorithm because the, the contrast is too low and it wouldn't work because it would run out of the lesion and get all the liver. Um, I recommend that you have a look at it, what I'm doing, and then after that you can repeat it. So just have a look at it. We have to go to the beginning of the lesion, maybe here, and we use a tool which is called closed polygon. And I try to mark up to highlight that lesion. And on the last um, point, I, I click twice, then the polygon is closed. I could do that in every single slice, but this may be a lot of work. So I decide, uh, Osirix will assist me with that. I go, I go down a couple of slices and do it again. So last click is double. And if it doesn't fit, we can all also move the points to adjust it. I go down a little bit more. Do it again. And oops, uh, go to the last slice where I'm seeing the lesion. Or I think that is the lesion. And that's it. Now I have maybe 10 slices with the lesion in it. And I have marked up uh, three or four um, closed polygons. Um, Osirix can calculate the missing polygons. For that, we have to name all the polygons the same name, which is done by the menu Roy, Roy rename. And I just say all Roy's in this series and I give it a name like one. So now the Roy's have the name one. And if I've done so, I can go to Roy, Roy volume, generate missing Roy's. So Osirix now has interpolated in all slices from the first row I've drawn and the last row and I've marked up this lesion. If I want, if I'm not satisfied with what, what, what the algorithm did, maybe here, I just can click on the row and move the little the bullets. Or there's another tool in the toolbar, the row toolbar, which is called the repulsor tool. I just click here and hold the left mouse button and I can push things in or things out just to get the right shape. And the tool is a smart tool that the closer we are clicking, the smaller it is. If I click far away, it will have a bigger size. So, and when we have done that, we just can go here, Roy, Roy volume, compute volume. And Osirix will compute the volume of our lesion. Here. Okay, now. Sorry. Yeah. I missed, uh, some uh, steps here. Yeah, I, I, told, I said that you should watch, and now we repeat it and we will go through step by step. Okay. Please delete all your ROIs if you have drawn some with a command, the command uh, key, it's right or left to the space bar and backspace. We delete all rows. Okay. Highlight or use the closed polygon here, Roy, closed polygon. Go to the beginning of the lesion and just do some, some clicks. Clicks, click, clicks. The last one, double click, then the polygon will close. Which is the button to get the polygon, sorry? Here, this is the, uh, wait, this one. The, Okay, gotcha. This one, just here, open up and highlight the closed polygon. You can also press the key C. It's a hot key for the closed polygon C. Okay, now we have one polygon. We go down a little bit, go down a little bit, draw the next closed row. And you do it three, four times. And important is we have to 
have Royce at the first and the last slice where we see the lesion, of course. If you have done it, we have to rename the ROYs because the ROYs now have no name. We have to rename them, ROY rename, and just say all ROYs in the series, all, and give it, I don't know, doesn't matter what name. Now all the ROYs have the name 222. And then go to the menu ROY. Again, Roy volume and choose generate missing Roy's and click on it. And if it worked, then you will see that there are Roy's in every slice. Why not generate missing Roy's? Then you have, um, maybe you have not highlighted a Roy, so just click on your Roy um, tool at the toolbar and click on one, just go to one slice with an ROI and click on it so that you see the blue points. And then try it again with ROI, ROI volume, generate missing ROIs. And the last step is easy, just click on compute volume and Osirix will cal calculate the volume for you. So there's always a discussion.